Hello guys and welcome to the next episode of Fallout 4 on the PlayStation 4 with me, Dark Death and Piper. Who's got on in the armor suit? I'll pull her in there, she looks pretty badass, but you can't actually see her face anymore, so that's annoying. It's pretty bad. It is like really dark here, it's mental. Say at some point in the morning. The sun is rising all the way over there. But it's nothing to do with that now because we are gonna travel to the institute. Institute? Can't difficult word to say, I'll be honest. We've had to build this machine here in the sanctuaries, just to show you where we are. Sanctuary, four people got here, 30% happiness. Can't really care about this place, I live in the castle. But yeah guys, hope you're doing alright, I'm doing quite well. Piper is burning out that fusion core. You may get a run, you haven't got a run. Yeah, I'm going to have to get her out of that suit, it's wasting fusion cores. I'm using two in the time that I usually use one. So I can't be doing that. What the hell? Okay, I don't know what that's doing. <laughs> that's completely lost here. Yeah, and first off guys, sorry for how late this video has come out. At the moment, I'm like four days since I had the last video out, maybe even five. It's been crazy, I've been at Easter, I've been ill, I've been working. I've had problems with my recording software a lot. I'm trying to test with different volumes to get better quality and it's really struggling at the moment. So, hopefully this works out well. But let's jump straight into it. You ready to see if this thing actually works? Hell yeah. Let's do this. You sure? Okay. Your part is simple. Just step onto the platform. I'll start scanning for an institute signal to lock onto. Then, I fire her up and we see what happens. Holy shit. Whenever you're ready. Just gotta step on. Simple as that. Simple as that. Here we go, guys. Let's find our son. I don't blame you. Where's Pipe? See you in a bit. Piper, I will smash you one day. <laughs> I will. Okay, hold real still. I don't want any corruption of the molecular beam. Oh yeah, by the way, I figured this was a golden opportunity to find out as much as we can about the Institute and what they're up to. Yeah, it, this holotape's all set with a program that will scan their network and download anything it finds. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, we better hurry. And don't worry about that tubing wiggling around. It's, uh, just there for decoration. Of course okay. it is. Scanning for the Institute signal. Tracking RF. And... Got it. Bye. Hold on to your butt. Jurassic Park, that is. Sorry about that pause as well, guys. Mother just walked in like, what? And I don't want to move. Molecular level. Right, guys, we're in. Give me all that XP. 572. Okay, I'm here. Hello? I wondered if you might make it here. You're quite resourceful. I'm known as Father. The Institute is under my guidance. I know why you're here. What the fuck is going on? I'd like to discuss things with you face to face. Please, step into the elevator. Um. I'm, I'm, I'm quite alright. I'm, I'm gonna chill out here. I'm gonna chill out here, yeah. Duct tape. I need that duct tape. I need the adhesive. Can't pronounce it. So, you know, feel free to laugh. For this shit. Right, guys, I wanna get a good weapon out of being down here. Signal rebooted, okay. That's us. Right, I've just done that. Uh, you, did you want me to put one in? Nope. Okay, I forget about that. Tell me to get down the elevator though, but I don't want to do that. Still telling me to go on there. What do you want me to do? Have I got 
wait for that thing to load at the bottom. I think so. Let me just see if I can, let me just load all the hollow tape. Nope, that's the game. No. <laughs> yes. Eject. Okay, I've all got course chip data. How about this? Whoa. Okay, I don't know what that's doing, but I'm going down here. I'm gonna see what's what. I'm gonna drop some shit. Is that in there? Oh, oh wow, there's two heights to it. That's pretty cool. I'm right with me, I don't, feel, I don't feel safe. Useless. Useless? Calm down, it's alright. <laughs> Denied, he's let me in. What? I can only imagine what you've heard, what you think of us. I'd like to show you that you may have. The wrong impression. Feels like we're twisting, look. Welcome to the Institute. Hang on, we are. The floor's moving. This Whoa. is the reality of the Institute. This place, these people, the work we do. Say so bad. For a hundred years, we've dedicated ourselves to humanity's survival. Decades of research, countless experiments and trials, a shared vision of how science can help shape the future. It has never been easy. And our actions are often misinterpreted by those above ground. Someday, perhaps, we can show them what we've accomplished. But for now, we must remain underground. There's too much at stake here to risk it all. As you've seen, things above are... unstable. Yeah, you're right. I'd like to talk to you about what we can do for everyone. But that can wait. You are here for a specific, very personal reason. What? You are here for your son. How do you know that? How do you know that? What? What do I feel like I'm gonna get kidnapped and put in an animus? <laughs> and else get that vibe? Is that Sean? Is that Sean? Hello? Let me in. Busted. No, 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 no. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? That's a spanner. Kid. Is that Sean? Did I, is that Sean? I don't have the key. Right, gotta get the key. Can't pick this. Freaking hell. Where is it then? No way to pick this. No kid. Sean. Sean. Oh. Yes, I'm Sean. No, if only you could see my face. Sean, I've been looking for you for so long. Who are you? They stole These you. Bad people. They they stole you from me. Father, what's going on? What's happening? Sean, are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? What's going on? Father? Father! The fuck I've scared him. He'll be alright. It'll be alright. Shh, shh, shh. It'll be okay, Sean. I'm here now. I don't know you. Go away. Father. Father, help me. There's someone here. Help me. Fuck, I've scared him. Who is Father? Where is he? Father? Father, help me. He's trying to take me. Father? Father, help me. 
You kidding me? One chance my son and I tried to do really S923, recall code Cirrus. The robot? But disappointing. The child's responses were not at all what I anticipated. That might have been my fault. You understand. We're only just now beginning to explore the effects of extreme emotional stimuli. Please try and keep an open mind. I recognize I'm gonna kill you. you emotional and that your journey here has been fraught with challenges. Let's start anew. I am Father. Welcome to the Institute. Mm, which gun do I use on you? I could kill you. Give me Sean. The real Sean. Right now! I know. I know. You've gone to such lengths to find him. I want answers, asshole. Now! Under the circumstances, I will forgive your vulgarity, but I need you to realize that this the subtitles situation is far more complicated than you could have imagined. You have traveled very far and suffered a great deal to find your son. Well, your tenacity and dedication have been rewarded. It's good to finally meet you. After all this time, it's me. I am Sean. I am your son. What? Nah. Nah. How is that even possible? I know this is a lot to take in. No, no, in no, you ain't. You had no concept of the passage of time. You were released from your pod and went searching for the sun. You'd lost. But then you learned that your son was no longer an infant, but a ten-year-old boy. You believed that ten years had passed. More time passed, didn't it? Really it so hard to accept that it was not ten, but six. Knew it. Years. I knew it. That is the reality. And here I am. Raised by the Institute, and now it's leader. Actually, you look, he looks just like me. They stole you, kidnapped you, it wasn't right. Right, wrong, irrelevant. It was necessary. The Institute believed humanity's future depended on it. At that time, the year 2227, the Institute had made great strides in synth production, but it was never enough. Scientific curiosity, and the goal of perfection drove them ever onward. What they wanted was the perfect machine. So they followed the best example thus far. The human being. Walking, talking, fully articulate, capable of anything. So the weird science experiments needed specimens. That's why they took you. In a manner of speaking. Yes. The Institute endeavored to create synthetic organics. The most logical starting point, of course, was human DNA. Plenty of that was available, of course. But it had all become corrupted. In this wasteland, radiation affected everyone. Even in their attempts to shield themselves from the world above, members of the Institute had been exposed Another source was necessary, but then the Institute found me after discovering records from Vault 111. An infant, frozen in time, protected from the radiation-induced mutations that had crept into every other human cell no, don't buy it. in the Commonwealth. You're a I was exactly what they needed. And so it was my DNA that became the basis of the synthetic organics used to create every human-like synth you see today. I am their father. What? Through science, we are family. The synths, me, and you. Nah, uh, nah, I don't believe you. I don't believe you. There's no way any of this is true. I wish there was something to say. I know this isn't what you wanted. But it's the only truth I can offer you. Why are you doing this to me? After everything I've been through. 
I don't mean any of this to hurt you. I'm just... I'm trying to help you. Help us. I've shown you my trust. Nah. Your weapons haven't been confiscated, and I stand unarmed before you. Please, let's just talk. Oh my god, where do we start? If this is true, where do we start? I know you must have questions. Please, anything I can do to help you understand. Kellogg. Kellogg. He worked for you? Kellogg. He was an institute asset long before I arrived here. It wasn't until I became director that I learned of all the things he'd done. What kind of man he was. You used him, yeah. Um, hang on. So Ke we just killed Kellogg, but he raised you. But now you're... And they froze me. So he's about 60, my son is. How did Kellogg raise him then? How did Kellogg not age? Was Kellogg a synth? What's going on? You knew the man was a psychopath, but you used him anyway? <laughs> I don't expect you to understand oh, or agree with this. Hold on, unless that little kid was the a Institute simp. took advantage of Kellogg's vicious nature. I see. I, will I get it now. admit that. Institute technology prolonged his life and his usefulness far beyond any normal human lifespan. He never failed the Institute. But his cruelty became more apparent with every completed objective. I won't lie. It's no coincidence your path crossed his. It seemed a fitting way to allow you... us... to have some amount of revenge. What else can I say to ease your mind? Your mother... She never got to see you grow up. Yes. What happened to her was... I've gone over the records of the incident, of course. It seems her death was an unfortunate bit of collateral damage. Collateral damage? It was brutal? <sighs> you don't remember. You didn't see it the way I did. It was brutal. Yes, I'm sure it was. Sadly, the world has become a brutal, unforgiving place. For many years, I never questioned who my parents were. I accepted my situation, and that was that. With old age comes regret, and asking what if more often. But what matters now is that you and I have a chance to begin again. What else can I say to ease your mind? So you're in charge of the Institute? I am the acting director, yes. I spent decades working to reach this point. It's a responsibility I take very seriously. The Institute. It's important. It really is humanity's best hope for the oh, future. His body's moving around before no they just stand there. Above ground really took me on. into the situation then. Pretty good. But... Director? Why you? I was the most qualified for the position. Obviously. I've lived my life within these walls. Dedicated to science like every other member of the Institute. My hard work has paid off. Ultimately, the Commonwealth has nothing to fear from us. Whatever you've seen or heard, I know I can convince you of that. Just give me time. I know there's more for us nah, to discuss. Nah, this is too, this is too weird. But the institute is on the verge of some important breakthroughs. Your presence would be appreciated as we approach them. I've been a part of something amazing here. I've helped to build a life for myself and the people of the institute. And now, after all these years, you have an opportunity to help with that. Doesn't that intrigue you? Isn't that what you want? Do I want to help? No, I don't want any of this. I don't, this is... What? You want me to stay here? In the Institute? Yes, that is what I propose. Is it so hard to imagine 
The Institute can provide a better life than anything above ground. You've been in the Commonwealth. You've seen what it's like. I assure you that you are better off with us. Disagree. Your Institute has done some horrible things. <sighs> yes, well... The world is not what it used to be. What about the people you've aided in order to get here? What atrocities have they committed? The Brotherhood of Steel. They believe they're the only ones fit to control technology and destroy anyone who opposes them. And you would side with them. None have any true claim to nobility in this world. Those days are gone. But we are not the monsters we have been cast as. I simply ask that you give the Institute, me, a chance. A chance to show you what I've been telling you. We really do have humanity's best interest at heart. Will you take that chance? So this is where, this is where. I have to question it. Are you sure you want this? Yes, I am. It would benefit us both to work together. Don't know. I just don't know. Just give it time. Give the Institute a chance. The Institute is now your home as much as it is mine. Please take some time, get to know it. Meet the people you'll be working with. You'll want to introduce yourself to the division heads. Dr. Fillmore. No, I don't need this. I can't be asked with the law of you. In SRB. Dr. Holdren in Bioscience. And finally, Dr. Lee in Advanced Systems. They've all been notified of your arrival, of course. Meet them, and then we'll discuss what comes next. Institute's there. CRT rooms are so close. Say right. Set network scan the holotype into your suit channel. That's what I'm supposed to do. Shit. <laughs> I should just look to do. Fuck. I need to do that. This isn't right. Sean. About this synth. You mean the child? It's a fascinating project, really. There are issues to be solved, of course, but we've made remarkable progress. You made a child synth. That looks like you. That's... It's... It's an abomination. It's a synth. Not a human being. A simulacrum. Try to be more open-minded. I'll make sure it's brought back online in the near future. You'll have an opportunity to interact with him further. But... I'll admit I'm curious. As a parent looking for a child... Looking for the younger version of me... What do you think? Do you think you could love him? Like you would a real boy? Love a synth. I don't need a synth. I found the real Sean. Yes, but not the Sean you were looking for. In some ways, the synth is far closer to what you expected. I wouldn't claim to know everything you're feeling, but... If in some small way the boy's presence can help, I hope you'll keep an open mind. I don't like this. At all. This is wrong. Go back and set that card. You are not my son. You're not. You're a monster. What the hell have we gone into? I'm not happy with this at all. These two elevators are, elevators are pointless from one to the other. It's just like, what are we seeing? I 
Take me off. Right, do we actually turn? I don't know why I turn. Look, I'm standing or something. I'm turning. I turn like that. Hollow tape is it? Certain networks scan a hollow tape. Get down to the ends. Network scanner. Sweet, okay. Download and download and scan complete. the way back out. No, we don't want to go out yet. Let's get back underneath. Wow, so my son basically made teleportation. Is that really what's happening? Cannot be open. Right, let's go back down and we need to explore the rest of this stupid place. Found our son, guys. 80 episodes. I know, I don't care if it took me 80 episodes too long or like 20 episodes too short to take it to 100. I, f I find it when I find him at the end of the day. I've done a lot of side missions and I'm happy that I've done that. Most people have done about 20 episodes on this. You know, they just do the main campaign and that's all you show you and then they go to another game or they just play about 10, don't even find this one, but then just go. It's an honor to have you here, sir. It must make you proud to see all that father has done, all that he has built. So, these all know about me? Why did my son try and find me? Instead of letting me walk around the wasteland? Almost done. Just need to tighten up this primary drive servo. That's the third primary drive breakdown this month. Excuse oh, me, Doctor. I don't know. Kidding. You really Most of them here. have lasted long well, past right. their projected lifespans. I'm Alec. Alec Fillmore. Me. You can think of me as well. the Institute's chief engineer. When Father told us about you, I could hardly believe it. You've been through so much, I think most people would have just given up. If you don't mind my asking, what was it that kept you going all that time? I just wanted to find my son and keep him safe. Now that you've found him, I hope you're proud of the great man he grew up to be. Now. No, I'm not. Give no, give me the option to sell, not. Division, and then I'll answer any questions you might have afterward. As you might guess, we keep the Institute's mechanical and electrical systems running smoothly. We maintain and upgrade all of the systems that make it possible to live and work in a place like this. There's a lot of machinery behind these walls that recycles the air and water and provides power to the laboratories and quarters. The work we do might not be as exciting as some of the other departments, but it's at least as important. So, now that you're here and you've spoken to Father, does that mean you're on board? With what? Board with what? The Institute, of course. Sean implied you operated on a level, if not equal, and at least similar to the rest of us. Curious. If there's anything else you'd like to know about the facilities division, I'm happy to discuss it. Oh, that's, this, this, is, this, is, this is awful. This place, originally. Has it been here long? The construction of the Institute is the work of generations of scientists. The original survivors of the war, our progenitors, took refuge in the basement of the old Commonwealth Institute of Technology. Over time, their sons and daughters dug deeper into the earth and built increasingly sophisticated habitats and laboratories. It's a process that's still going on today. Even now, we're digging out tunnels for new facilities and infrastructure. Just think what this place will look like a hundred years from now. I hope I'm there to see it. I can't argue with that. Even so, I'm ready to see the full Gen 3 roll. Oh man, this there is, this go. is, this is the... <laughs> Unit, you can return to duty. No more robots. Thanks again. Call that all of you. I can provide supplies. So you guys, like, you know stuff like virtual reality gaming all that stuff? I don't, I don't like, it's just too... It's, nah. Just, just look. If, if, just, instead of virtual reality, just 
Wow, I'm back here again. The virtual reality. Just go around, go outside, kick a ball. Damaged camera. I say nothing's gonna be damaged here, isn't it? Clean, preserved. Look, see all that shit. Yeah, I don't like virtual reality kind of stuff like that. I don't like the way they make the robots so lifelike. It's the fact that you can, in the future, they want to download your emotions into it. It's just not for me. I think that stuff's freaky. It's gonna be like, oh, ro I robot. Computer's just gonna dominate the world or something like that. Nah, it's not for me. I like if the institute is the fourth place that you can join. Well, he asked me to join him. I bet this is the fourth place, isn't it? The institute. Wow. What an absolute mess up of the brain. I can't, I can't describe. I don't know. I'm looking for bottle caps. Where are you gonna be one? Is this a bed? Shit me. Rank zero X zero right one. Is it the R at the start? No. Kind nope. Right then, find some duds. Give me some lives back or something. <laughs> We've been over all these now. Shit, one more. Okay, kind of zero, rate one. So let's find. Could it be hand? No, because that ends in D, so that ends of zero. Okay, hope. Hope it could be. It's gotta be hope. Nice, yes. Kellogg? Wow. If you want to read this, guys, pause because I'm just going to blast through it. If you want to go to the present, you need to observe the others. The first, they fought in murder, taking their body confidence, and regret, or perhaps they were afraid of general abuse. Kellogg is, after all, a Kellogg, but I've continued to witness their reactions. Gorge their slime of hands and have to take something else, something I probably should anticipate. Jealousy. Kellogg is a living memorial to forget and program. He is a normal human being, a cyborg, really, you know, this is something that can be denied, but really, a cyborg is something you not less care about you. Reflexes were great to come out of defense, but no, of course, there are many. So, the more practical and more prime ways in Hans' life is put in just now. Well, they can't live sitting past that tree. That may be, it's hard to say. He's already more than 100 years old. Wow, older certainly. Been over human in the coma of his completed physical and been altered. Perhaps he'll make it 150, maybe 200. Not anymore, mate. I've killed him. With a pair of the chances, his character is a living testament. Why it continues? Ayo can only confirm sighting of Site Vault 111. I'm getting a dime to see something like what that means, I'm not sure. Will we actually meet? Was this all for nothing? No, not nothing. I will have learned valuable things about myself, my past, the evil way. I cannot afford to let my emotion get in the way. I must seek to observe and record. I told Kellogg has. I am told Kellogg has gone offline. Strangely, I find myself thinking of Dr. Walker. He had such high hopes for Kellogg, such faith in, in, such faith, such faith in the implants. 
what it could mean. I still regret eliminating my products, but I know where it would have led us. Wolf was never shy about his goals, too many of us are starting to listen. In the end, I believe it was justified. The industry is about preserving humanity, not some bizarre, I can't pronounce that word, a amalgamation of biology and technology. Um, oh, that's for me actually. Shut down a sec. Wow, we've actually learned to be. Sean's terminal password. Wow. I need these. What's in here? So pissed off, we found our son, guys, and it's just not what I thought it would be. I was, I was hoping tears would be running down my eyes, but no. Look at this. What is this even about? I'm just so let down. Sometimes. Shut up! Don't talk to me. You're a freak. But my mom says I have to be nice anyway. Hi there. Hi. Isn't it wonderful here? Are you a synth? I wish Quentin would stop telling those stupid stories. My daddy says your father's daddy, but he looks so much older than you. Yeah, it's... it's been quite a mess, I'll be honest, kid. I wonder where I ended up back here. I see a big maze. I made the fuck shit up! Right, let's get to this one. It says there's one dead ahead, if you look here. You know the protocol, sir. Authorized personnel only. So Dr. Ayo thinks he can hide in his office, does he? Operating well, you can tell him that capacity. I intend to speak to Father about the unannounced security. Heading over to robotics to knock some heads together. You're here. What now? Glad you made it. Carry on, sir. Thank you. Maybe I should take some courses with me. You know, send a message. Please don't. There's enough friction as it is between us and pretty much all the other... Oi, Dr. So... Here you are. Justin Ayo, acting director of the Synth Retention Bureau. I'll be up front with you. We're going to be keeping a close eye on you for the near future. Despite your relation to father, you're a bit of an unknown quantity. I'm sure you understand. There won't be any issues, will there? Don't trust me. Why? Don't you trust me? I'll be honest. You're an outsider. The first outsider to be allowed access to the Institute in quite a long time, in fact. There's little precedent for this situation, so it's only natural to take extra precautions, hmm? It's nothing personal, I assure you. Now, Father has asked that I provide you with a brief overview of the Synth Retention Bureau. Our primary responsibility is the recovery of escaped Synths that are hiding among the human population on the surface. So basically, you're the secret police. Secret police? If that's a pre-war reference, then I'm afraid it's lost on me. Our main instrument is the Courser, a third-generation synth assigned to operate on the surface. Coursers hunt down and reclaim synths that have escaped the Institute. They are highly self-sufficient, trained in combat, infiltration, and tracking. In a word, our Coursers are relentless. Well, I gather you know all this, since you've encountered one already. In fact, I'd very much like to know how you defeated it. It was useless. Combat experience. I'm no stranger to combat. Even so, a courser should be more than a match for any single combatant. I suppose I'll have to ask robotics to perform detailed diagnostics on the entire production run. As if we don't have enough problems. Now, unless you need something else, I'll get back to work. Good for now. I'm good for now. Thanks. Very well. Guys, we're going to end it here, and I am so disappointed. Oh, I found my son, but my son is like... He's head of some kind of evil organization. I don't know what to say. I am not happy with this at all. Guys, I'm going to catch you in the next episode. We're going to talk to him a bit more, and then look around this place, but this is an actual nightmare. My kid was working. My kid is the bad guy, basically. It's very clever, I suppose, but at the same time, I don't like the fact that it's to do with all these robots. Mankind don't trust them. Redefined. What can I say? It's what the game has fruit me so far. I'll see you in the next one, guys. If you enjoyed, please give a like, comment, and subscribe. And, you know, at least we found our son. Now we're on a rifle. Oh, we are gonna... 
take have loads of shit. On you, would you? Because this is mine now. Nope, Institute Pistol, that one. Get away. Right, guys, we've got all them. I'll see you in the next one.